Hello and welcome to my A to Z general knowledge and trivia quiz. There are 26 questions. The answer to number one will begin with the letter A. The answer to number two will begin with the letter B. Down to 26, which will begin with the letter Z. I hope you enjoy the quiz. And good luck. Thank you, Paige. Beginning with A, sworn under oath in court. What name is given to a written document that gives a truthful version of facts or events? The answer is affidavit. Beginning with B, who played the title role in the 1982 film Gandhi? He was played by Ben Kingsley. Beginning with C, first created in 1953, the dish Poulet Reine Elizabeth is better known as what? It's better known as a coronation chicken. Beginning with D, globally, Ammonita phylloides is responsible for about 90% of mushroom related deaths. What is it more commonly known as? It's more commonly known as death cap. Beginning with E, sought by Spanish explorers in the 16th century, what is the name of the legendary treasure city of South America? The answer is El Dorado. Beginning with F, which plant is named after German botanist Leonhard Fuchs? That is Fuchsia. Beginning with G, what is the name of the four treaties and three additional protocols that form the core of international humanitarian law? The Geneva Conventions. Beginning with H, whose face was said to have launched a thousand ships. Thank you, Paige. The answer is Helen of Troy. Beginning with I, what was the final album released by Queen in Freddie Mercury's lifetime? The album was called Innuendo. Beginning with J, which well-known author was the sister of Joan Collins? That is Jackie Collins. Beginning with K, originating from the Netherlands, what is the only mixed-sex team ball sport in the world? And very well done if you said Corfball. Beginning with L, the Vitruvian Man is a drawing by who? Leonardo da Vinci. Beginning with M, in geometry, which measure is equal to 1 60th of a degree? is a minute. Beginning with N, which ship in the Matrix film series is named after a Babylonian king? The ship is called the Nebuchadnezzar. Beginning with O, what is the national gemstone of Australia? Opal. Beginning with P, which Middle East archaeological site was once described as a rose red city half as old as time? The 
The answer is Petra. Beginning with Q. Any of five children born at the same time to the same mother are called what? Quintuplet. Beginning with R. There are two books in the Christian Bible that are specifically named after women. Esther is one, what is the other? The other is Ruth. Beginning with S, what name is given to the form of inflation, most common in food and beverages, that consists of reducing a product's size while maintaining its retail price? And there's been a lot of this recently. The answer is shrinkflation. Beginning with T, also the name of a sci-fi horror TV series, what name is given to the layer of the ocean that lies between 200 to 1,000 metres below the surface of the ocean? That's called the Twilight Zone. Beginning with you, enabling the transfer of oxygen and nutrients, what connects a mother and baby during pregnancy? Umbilical cord. Beginning with V, starring Mark Warren, which television crime drama is about a Dutch detective who takes on criminal cases in Amsterdam. It's a loose remake of the original series that ran from 1972 to 1992. Van der Vork. Beginning with W, what is the only novel by the English author Emily Bronte? Wuthering Heights. Beginning with X, known to exist in Mexico for over 3,000 years, which breed of dog is generally considered as the first dog of the Americas? That is Jolo. Beginning with Y, one of the world's largest, the Free Gorges Dam is a hydroelectric dam that spans which river? Yangtze. Beginning with Z, with the symbols ZN and ZR, which two chemical elements begin with the letter Z? The answers are zinc and zirconium. And now for this week's bonus question, the answer to this will begin with a number. By area, how many countries in the world are larger than Australia? So by area, how many countries in the world are larger than Australia? So if you think you know it or you'd like to have a guess, tell me in the comments below. So that's the end of the quiz. Really big thank you for playing. I hope you had fun. If you did enjoy it, please click the like button and to subscribe, please click on the logo. Now you may have heard a little voice helping me with today's quiz. That little voice is my niece Paige, who told me earlier that she would like to be a YouTuber when she's older. So Paige, could you say one final message? Thank you for playing and goodbye.